Now, one of the other factors which was affecting demand was the taste and preferences of customers. Now the taste and preference of the customer can either go in favor or against a particular commodity. Now whenever there is a change of taste and preferences of the customer in the favor of a good, its demand will increase and whenever it's against a good the demand will decrease. If you try to plot this in the price axis and the quantity axis the price remaining the same if let's say at this price Q1 was the quantity which was demanded at a particular price whenever there is a favorable change the demand curve will move right and at the same price the quantity that will be demanded will be higher whereas if there is a favor there is a change against in the quantity let's say this is Q3 this is Q2 and let me just plot some numbers here the quantity which will be demanded if it goes against will be low price remaining the same so in this case even though the price does not increase or decrease there was a change in the quantum of the particular commodity which was demanded just because there was a change in the taste and preferences of the customer in the favor or against a particular good.